We're here with Gavin Ashton. Yes. One place you haven't ridden in Kentucky, and it brought an immediate reaction out of you, is Kentucky Downs. And I'll let you take it from there. I said Kentucky Downs, and you said... Correct. I, I would love to ride there. Obviously, it's, um, it's very similar to tracks that I ride on at home and that I've um, grown up riding. So I really feel as though my... Um, I really feel as I'll benefit, my, my, my talent will uh, really shine there and it's a track that I can't wait to get over and um, hopefully uh, hopefully can pick up some live mounts there and this year and uh, see how things go. Have you for a little bit of light reading looked at their condition book? I have, yeah, I, I, that's why I know it's going to be incredibly tough to uh, to get mounts there because I know the money on offer is uh, very competitive and um, obviously I, I, I watched it last year there and it's always full fields and everything so um, <laughs> Yeah, I'm, uh, I'm really looking forward to going there, that's for sure. The full fields give a new rider a chance to get on horses, but <laughs> it also brings in a lot of jockeys there. That's from... right. Obviously, live mounts are hard to come by. You might be able to pick up um, pick up mounts, and obviously anything that you can get on there is uh, would be great. Uh, but I know how, how competitive it is there and how tough it is uh, of a meet. So, yeah, look, I've, I'll just go into it with an open mind and... Um, any chances that get thrown my way, I'll certainly hope to make the most of. Okay, tell us a little about yourself, where you, you grew up and how you ended up in Kentucky. Um, so obviously I'm from England, originally Manchester, um, and I only, um, horse racing was not in the family, nothing, I had no family, no friends in it, and um, I only came into it at the age of 20, was when I first ever sat on a horse, or touched a horse. Um, so that was seven years ago, I went down to the racing school uh, in Newmarket, and I was very lucky, I worked for some very good trainers in uh, Sir Mark Prescott and Roger Varian over in England. Um, I rode quite a bit in Germany and places like that and that's where I really kind of learned to get hold of horses and how to ride and um, I've been very lucky who I've been mentored by um, and then like I say I came over here a year ago uh, or just under a year ago and uh, things have gone incredibly well for me. I got off to a great start at Colonial last year and heading back there this summer so really looking forward to that meet we're going in there with plenty of business this year so hoping to capitalize on that and um yeah i've been very blessed to have a a, a great agent from the get-go over here in liz morris so um yeah things going really well and long way it continue you were backtracking what your family wasn't in racing what so what got you interested in racing? <laughs> so i've always been an athlete i've always wanted to i i knew i wanted to be a professional athlete and whatever it was that i did i've always played sport soccer was obviously my thing growing up um I played for a good level there, but my size always held me back. And it was when I was working in a restaurant as a, as a chef that somebody said to me, are oh, you the right size to be a jockey? And I was like, well, that's probably the only sport I've never actually given a go at. And went home to mum and dad, I was going to be a jockey. They kind of laughed at it, and but I was determined and they supported me every step of the way. And um, yeah, seven years later, here I find myself on the other side of the world doing what I absolutely love so um, and it's a dream come true for me so I'm blessed I, I knew having visited America this was always where I wanted to be you know I love the weather the people the food everything about the, the place so um, yeah when I got introduced to the racing over here it was it was a no-brainer for me and it was where I wanted to be excited on Kentucky because yeah um, purely because of the business was here you know uh, my agent is based here Liz Morris she does uh, She's got very good connections here, and um, I mean, look at the money that's available here. And this, this is this is where the best racing is. This is where you want to be. You know, it's tough. Obviously, the money attracts the best jockeys, but I feel as though you learn most when you're riding with this colony of jockeys. And it's such an honour and a pleasure to be riding at, at, at these meets with these guys and for these trainers. So I feel as though if you work hard enough, the chances will come, and you've just got to take them when they do.